it's always two sides of every story and it's options to everything and growing up in the inner city Akron I, I saw a lot of drug dealing I saw a lot of gang violence. We're actually on our way to Wanville Elementary and uh, I go every Wednesday and what I do is I read to a, a couple classes and I meet with my I have a group of 10 fourth grade boys that I just chat around with and uh, mentor. How you doing? Good, Good to guy. see you. Yeah, I'm all ready What's for up, y'all? Y'all here reading. What's good? Yeah. What up, what up, what up? Hey, who played last night? Didn't y'all have a playoff game? I when I meet with them, we usually, we, I always try to pick a topic and we talk about it. Yeah. So, I named them. They're called LaTroy's boys. <laughs> <laughs> well, so today we're going to talk about goals and setting goals. Tell me what y'all what know about. Just tell me what y'all know about goals. I mean, these kids are so intelligent. I may prompt a question sometimes and expect uh, a three, four word answer and they sit there and just give me some off the wall, profound, intellectual answer, and it just reminds me that I, I feel like it's our job to help them hone that intellectual ability, athletic ability, and help them bring it out to help other people. Be at practice. Be at practice on time? That's a good, that's a good short term goal. I just really look around and it uh, reminds me a lot of home. It reminds me of East Akron. And uh, so when I go talk to these kids and talk to these boys, it's, it's kind of like I'm talking to a younger version of myself sometimes. It's my short term goal is to do my best every day. So I always think like, whatever I'm doing, am I doing it to the best of my ability? Because that's my short term goal. My name is Jeremy, my, my goal is to be a pro. These same people I grew up in the same hood with, went to the same schools, went to the same parks and played basketball at, were selling drugs and I'm going to sign a letter of intent. And they had every bit of ability, every bit of um, academic ability athletic ability as I did, but we went down different paths in life and I decided that the difference became we had different people pour into us. And that's why I do what I do here at Longsdale. All of our friends, you know, as Division One athletes in the SEC at the University of Tennessee, in Knoxville, Tennessee, we have a platform and we have influence. Who can tell me what the book was really all about? Yes, ma'am, on the right track. For Friendship. Sure. Friendship. Nice, that was a good answer. This is bigger than football. This is bigger than Latroy Lewis. This is bigger than the University of Tennessee because it's impacting our world. I, I don't know if I'm in there talking to the next president of the United States. I'm, I may be influencing a kid, like I said, from being a drug dealer, from being a congressman. And there's no telling what, what these kids can do and how they can impact the world. So I just hope I can do everything I can to impact them. So nice out today. <laughs>